My name is Frances Gibson, and I'm the owner of Dover Grace Alternative Boutique. And the store um, opened on September 15th, 2012. And the store is based on girls and self-esteem. There's no negative self-talk in the store. So you say three bad things about yourself, I put you in time out. So you say three positive things about yourself. One kind word can change someone's life. And I found that that's true for me growing up. Um, I've been picked on a lot and uh, made to feel a little bit uncomfortable in my own skin. So I really want to be a platform for these young girls who they go to school, but then, oh my gosh, the boy's shorter than, than me, so I can't wear the heels that I love. Why? Because the guy's shorter? That's silly. When people come in, they're awkward because maybe they've never been to a dance or the boys don't know how to put in their tuxedos or anything like that. Once you teach them how to dress for their body, also to work within their budget because it's financially responsible, you don't have to spend a bazillion dollars, um, they have this confidence. So when they go in for that interview, they're going to feel good about themselves. Every day someone will cry in my fitting room because um, they can't even raise their eyes to look at themselves in the mirror sometimes. That's how hard young women have it. They're very vulnerable. For me, to, someone to be standing there naked, basically, and we zip them in a dress, and there's no mirrors, and we walk them down there, and they get to look at themselves. They don't see what we see, and we make sure that they see really how beautiful they are. We have things by color, not by size, because if you like that color, just wear it. And if it doesn't fit, I'll fix it so it does fit. I put more moms in time out than I do their daughters because sometimes they're just tired and boy do I get it. So it's nice for them to know that there's another mama out there. Um, it does uh, take all of us to, um, to keep our children positive. But if you have someone who makes you feel safe, that you can say what you want and do what you want um, in, a, in a healthy, wholesome way, then um, I want to support that. There's no reason why people can't just embrace themselves. If you forget for just a minute and start giggling and laughing and, and, and just trying on clothes and being wherever you are, wherever you are, um, and happy for that moment, gosh, your whole week's better. When you hurt someone's spirit and they start feeling bad about themselves, they start believing those negative things they say about themselves, and um, even with a lot of the social media, is sort of making people feel bad about being the color of their skin, the color of their hair, the color of their eyes, how big they are, how small they are. Um, and then I see a lot of kids come in and they, um, they're sad, they're depressed, and they're overwhelmed. And um, they should be happy. And it just sort of hurts my spirit. So we just want to have a positive environment that um, each person, we have a motto, um, is you matter here. So everybody matters. So we treat you the best that we can. And there's a lot of hugs, a lot of giggles here, and it's a little crazy, but um, it is absolutely my joy. Sometimes um, I do pull the rack in front of the, the window and just turn on some really good music and have a dance or two. <laughs> That's the truth.